First Alert Weather with Caitlin Napoleone. 515. Good Friday morning, everyone. It is weather-wise a fantastic day. 72 right now in Burlington. Plenty warm. About 10 degrees above the average and 64 in Plattsburgh. So a little bit behind, but it still feels great. 58 in Montpelier. Cooler there as well as Lebanon and Bennington. 60 degrees in Rutland. Storm trackers empty. Had some overnight high wispy clouds. Those have moved on out and it's mostly clear now. We even have very little fog compared to the last couple of mornings. So that's good news, but if you come across some of that in our usual places, be careful. Then by the afternoon, we're left with basically the sunshine. It's going to be a mostly sunny day like it has been the last couple of days, and it's going to help us warm up. About 84 by noontime, we'll be up towards 90 by that 2, 3 o'clock hour. It's going to be hot out. The southerly wind around 10, maybe up to 15 miles per hour, certainly going to help warm us up, as well as the sunshine, which we have plenty of. Here on your surface analysis, you can see there's that nice clear sky. It doesn't last long, though. A cold front is basically knocking on our door at this point, and it does arrive for later on tonight, and will continue to pass throughout the day tomorrow. It will prompt the showers and a couple of thunderstorms, too. Future cast shows us mostly dry through the day, though, so we do get to enjoy one nice, pleasant afternoon. Then, probably around dinner time, slightly after, clouds are creeping in along with some of those spotty showers, the occasional thunderstorm. I think just, just after midnight we'll see a better chance for any thunderstorms, but uh, just a few of those popping up. You might hear some thunder while you're sleeping. In the early morning hours, the rain and maybe a couple thunderstorms pass through the rest of Vermont, and then we'll potentially see another round of those scattered showers and the occasional storm on Saturday afternoon. As you can see, very few of those. We even see a little bit of sunshine in between. On Sunday, a chance for a couple of those spotty, very light showers, most of those in the mountains, mostly just more of that sunshine reappearing and also the cool down that will leave us in the 70s on Sunday. From there, we just continue that dry up and we also warm back up for next week too.